Hello everyone, praise good here, and welcome back to more Splatoon 3. Last time, we cleared up every other main level of this, and I think we've actually collected everything in Site 1 at this point. Like, it, it's kind of co collected and discovered. And after, um, I'll just show us like this, but after redoing, oop, not that level, uh, this one? Yeah, after redoing this level with the hero shot, just to get 300 more power eggs, I have enough to actually clear this out. And I will say, I think that maybe... Oh, hey, you know what? That helps. Okay, I just noticed that we're going to do a couple things here. So, clearing all of the, uh, what is it? Getting your first clear of a level nets you the most power eggs. But if you do, but if you go back to it again, you still get power eggs for beating it with a new, with any weapon. So... You can redo a stage with the same weapon if you want to, but it uh, it has diminishing returns. Whereas the first time we cleared this level, I think we got 600 power eggs. This time we this time when I cleared it with the hero shot, I only got 300. Anyway, what caught my interest was this stuff over here. Wow, I don't have to edit a cursor on screen. Isn't that wild? Um, basically, what this says is all song and seas girls are gathered, all sardine acquired. All music acquired and all capsules otherwise acquired. There's probably going to be two more for all weapon types completed here and all levels completed. Or all levels completed and then all level t or weapon types per level will be, will be here. So I think it's going to be like six icons here to say how much you've done an area. Anyway, don't be rambling about potential 100%ing. Let's clear off this fuzz. Fuzz no more. More? Uh, I was expecting a boss, you know. Hold it right there! Who are you supposed to be? It's them. We're not supposed to speed anything. But I'll tell you who we are. Say with Sizzle, I'm Fry! You think you're cool. Shocks coming cold-blooded. You can call me Shiver. Hey. Hey. Splendid are out We only we only want Lou here. Hey. We are deep cut. How do your How do your fingers How do your fingers What? I I love them. All right, Callie sniffing. <laughs> Whatever. What do you want anyway? Wait, did you say deep cut? The deep cut from that anarchy splatcast thing? Yeah, it's called the day job. You should look into it. Banditing is our real passion. Nothing can stop us. Hey, to interrupt, Fry. Boy, have you looked around? You've hit the jackpot. Who knew this was here? All this time, treasure just sitting here under the crater. Now it's our turn for the now it's our for the taking. Hey, are you gonna try and stop us or what? Cause you totally can't. We're taking all of it for ourselves. Wow, it's like they rehearsed this whole thing. They are total pros. I heard that laugh shiver. Oh, they don't seem scared. What do you have to do to scare someone these days? Existential dread, uh, dread, existential dread. Fry, look into it. <laughs> anyway, hey, nothing they want to ask, but I'm over this conversation. I'm, I'm zeroing in on voices for them. The switch is ours. I'd wish you luck, but uh, I don't want to. Catch you later. Oh my god, they're so cool! So is that it? Well, you know, I'm not gonna lie, I expected, you know... That's it? There's still a point of interest here, but I can't do anything with this point of interest. Just tell me when to come back to that. Anyway, I'm moving on. Before I hurt myself. You know what? I gotta explore it further, it's, it's gonna drive me nuts. Oh, he found something? Oh, wow. 
Well, more power eggs is more power eggs, but okay. Well, even though it says there's a point of interest, I can't do anything with this. I can't ink any of it. I can't go up those stairs or ink or slide it in behind the stairs. Like I can't do anything here. So why do you mark this as a point of interest? And anyway, I'm going, I'm going back to where I need to go. I need going back to where I need to go to, to continue forward. Well, site one completed. Let's move on to site two. Ooh, hey, it's like I'm right there with you, Agent 3. To your right, you can see the mysterious fuzzy rocket in the distance. Oh, huh, that's a new sentence. We're almost there. Get ready. Yo, oh, fuff. I don't like this. Oh, hey, beacon. Hmm, this is the second hit site. It has a lot going on, doesn't it? Whoa, Agent 3. It's getting I'm getting a strong reading from way up there. Could it be, could be Gramps. Let's go check it out. Oh my, okay, it stopped. I was like, don't tell me I have to hear that every single, don't tell me I have to hear that now. Uh, 200. Yeah, I don't, yeah, you know what? I don't like my money. Hold on, I'm just gonna make sure. There, I'm gonna make sure I actually hit it. Yeah, I don't like my money. Oh. Yeah? The, the obvious thing. Uh, oh. Um. I mean, hey, there we go. <laughs> it's just like, hey, there we go. There we go. I did it. All right. Now watch this be like 800. I hate myself. <laughs> okay. Hello? Um, so it looks like, so anyway, it seems like, uh, completely filling in the site one map did nothing in terms of like a completion reward. So we won't, so I won't have to like redo any, uh, any of that junk. I'm going to hate myself, aren't I? Okay, good. No, en no entry fee. Well, that all being done. Huh. I'm just going to. Slide in here. I'm just gonna slide into those DMs if you don't mind me doing so. And take out a precarious one. Can I hit? Hold on. Looking around. Can I hit something? All right. You know what? we're gonna experiment a little bit with overworld exploration. We're gonna experiment a little bit with overworld exploration. <laughs> See how much we can go through without like. Throwing stuff around. I'm eventually going to clear up all the all the gunk and fuzz. That's my end goal. But I want to see how much how much I can get away with without cleaning up a single thing. Hello. Thank you, buddy. Ooh, Muzak. Muzak. Also, I have not been looking for like things under, hidden underneath. I'm just hoping little buddy will guide me where I got to go. Also, I've been seeing that like there have been arrows over a lot of things, so I. I feel like they planned for you to be able to do this in some capacity. Yee! Yee! <laughs> yeah, especially because I can like literally just bullseye this vent down here. Up a little bit. Oh, does it not reach? Ah, it probably would reach if I was actually a better shot. All right, now we're inside. We're inside the complex. I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me. I, uh, I see me trying to be smart was actually stupid. I can make that jump. I can still make that jump. Huh. Okay. Oh, small fry found something. Uh, small fry, don't hurt yourself. It's really trying to find something. Here, let me help you. There we go. I guess it is paying to just be dumb and explore as I w however I wish. Anyway, I'm going up top here. No. 
I'm not gonna be able to go up top there, actually. So let's- oh! I like how I thought I was being super, super stealthy, and then I wasn't. It's almost like the game is telling me I'm wrong. Sorry, I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying, like, seeing how much I can get away with right now. Hit it. Yeah! There's that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see how much- I really wanted to see how much I can get away with at this point. Ooh, sardinium. Uh, shoot that. I don't see any of the levels on this back side here right now. Oh, did it? Okay, he is on my back, so... More sardinium! Okay, let me go back- oh boy. And now he's out of my bag. Anyway. Huh, weird. It's like... It's like Small Fry jumped out of my bag. As soon as I thought I was near something... As soon as it thought I could get at something... Wait, that's Inkable on the left. Can I jump through that? Yes, I can. Okay. <laughs> well, don't mind me. I... Yeah, don't mind me. I'm definitely just going to break this break this game wide open. And go wherever I desire. That being said, I'm probably not supposed to be here. You know, I feel like I'm going to get enough power eggs to like open up any stage any stage in this game from here. I don't think I like how the fact that Small Fry just Small Fry Okay, no, he's not glowing, so it's okay. Him, oh, him, uh, small fry jumping to me definitely, like, makes me think I'm doing something wrong. Okay. Whatever this ink rail is, it goes from the car. Ooh. But yeah, just <laughs> break the game. Oh. Oh, I thought it was stopped. I wasn't stopped yet. I have yet to be stopped. The game does not know how stubborn I am. Yeah. <laughs> I hate that I'm being this stubborn with the game, by the way. The lobby I've built doesn't have a single standout feature, because everything in there is feature-worthy. If you don't have the greatest turf war experience ever, I'll get I'll eat at the smaller my own two claws. Feel the crab. Cute. Another one? Ooh, I can do another one. And considering that first stage has no uh, entry fee, I'm going to do it. So I think with this, I could probably actually get around the entirety of the lo of this a area now. Ooh, hey, goodies. But yeah, I feel like I can get around like the entirety of the of this area now. Whether I will use that for good remains to be seen. Okay. And not being goofy, let's actually go back to where we all started and actually uh, gets, gets, get a little bit of level in. Because all we've done so far is just explore. And I have no money, so. Now I did say I would like to get more ink recovery up, so... I do have... I do have three. Let's unlock access to this. Gimme. Just gimme as much as I can get access to right now. No, no, I've got the points for this. I'm gonna get uh, just gimme gimme. Well, I have ink resistance. I can get access to curling bombs next, and even better hero shot. I feel like I'm gonna try and beeline for that even better hero shot after I get ink tank capacity, because I'm gonna spend my sardinium as quickly as I can. Man, I'm just kind of going this upper route. Anyway, well, well, I was about to go into a level, and then small fry said thing. Okay, so I think Small Fry mainly finds hidden power eggs. Well, negotiate. Okay, let's let's see what we got going on here, because I don't think I'll do a level with the hero shot. I think most of the hero shot stuff, I'll save. Excuse me, I'll save hero shot stuff for when I'm playing by my uh, playing for myself, or you know, 
When I play by myself or what do you want to call it? Range blaster splat bomb. Mm. I don't really I've used a blaster in another level, so let's try a mini let's try a mini splat thing. I don't think I've ever used one of these. Um I'll save all these like extra weapon variants for my own time. But as of right now, okay. But as of right now, you know, I'll just I'll play different weapons as we go. Just to kind of show all the weapons that are in Splatoon for anybody who's never experienced Splatoon. Oh no, it's fine. It's fine, I'll work on this. Okay, that one didn't work. Well, there is a way to sneak behind it. It's just going to take a hot minute. But yeah, the Splatlings are... The Splatlings are very much weapons, are very much chain gun weapons. And your mileage may vary for what kind of Splatling you like. Like the mini Splatling is more for the person who still wants to have like mobility and rate of fire. Uh, the standard Splatling is like somebody who understands that ch that mini guns and chain guns will have problems with movement from time to time. And will plan around that. There's also something called the Hydra Splatling. The Hydra Splatling is basically the I'm going once I am ready to start shooting, I will not I will not I will not move from this position and I will just shoot. I will just shoot until everything is dead or until something is dead, whether it's me or the enemy remains to be seen. Okay. I'm trying to see if I can line this up cuz I want to sure I can get inside there. Ah. Oh. Boo. Can I jump? I cannot jump. Again, you gotta try... Again. Nintendo and Splatoon and the uh, dev team who makes Splatoon. Hit me up. I got ideas for Splatoon 4. First of all, stages. Save point jumping. I guess I kind of like the mini Splatling. I never... Oddly enough, I never used the mini Splatling in a Splatoon 2. Even though that definitely was a thing in Splatoon 2. Really? I guess, it's a, I guess they gotta be a deadly shot. But yeah. Jumping is a button. Good job, me. Well, I checkpointed. Ooh, they even gave me my, my special back. Oh, that didn't work how I wanted it to. You can try and shoot me. Good, good job. Good year. What's up? But yeah, so... I don't know. Splatlings are, are fun weapons. But again, I've never really used a mini Splatling. This feels nice. I don't hate it. But I feel like it's better used in somebody else's hands than mine. Anyway. My uh, existential crisis of sorts aside... Yeah, my, ex my existential crisis of sorts aside, we got that handled, and, uh, you know, let's go read that log before we end things off. I know today was mostly just map exploration, but, uh, eh, nothing's perfect, right? Nothing's perfect when it comes to doing things blind. Oh, hey, we can see all the kettles and everything. Huh. Neat. <laughs> I have unlocked every kettle, kettle I think. Anyway, ooh, the alternative logs. So, there was more to this. For a while, humanity was being decimated. Marine life flourished. All men of squid, octopus, and jellyfish had propagated in the deep. The surviving humans had found a source of sustenance. Maybe I'll read this all, all together. Oop, analyzing. Ooh, spoopy. Anyway, everyone, I do want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of Splatoon 3. And come back next time, we'll probably be doing mostly stages. Yeah, mostly stages. I'll clean this place out at another point. Oh, hi. Thanks, Callie. Is this to make up for Splatoon 2? Anyway, I'll see you folks next time. Take care.